Hello everybody, welcome to Keep Essex Active YouTube channel. My name's Stacey and today with Yogi's Rising, we're going on a yoga journey through the jungle. Would you like to join me? First of all, let's say hello in the yoga way. Bringing your hands together to your heart center. Namaste. Wonderful. Coming down to your mats, onto your knees. How about on our yoga journey through the jungle, we ride an elephant? Should we do some elephants breathing? Bringing your hands above your head, breathing in, forming your trunk, blow all of the air out. Fantastic. Breathing in, forming your elephant's trunk. Should we do that one more time? Breathing in. Okay, so now it's time to ride our elephants. Coming on to all fours. Making your tummies nice and strong. Breathing in, lift your trunk, arching your back, breathing out. Blowing all the air out of your trunk. Breathing in, arching your back, lifting your trunk. Breathing out, blowing all the air out of your trunk. And one more time, breathing in, Lifting your trunk. And breathing all the air out of your trunk. So what might we see in the jungle? Lots of danger, I think. Bending your elbows, sliding through. Push your feet away. Put your hands underneath your shoulders. Push your pelvis forward. Breathing in, lift up into a cobra. We can make a cobra noise. Breathing out, coming all the way down, hiding back in the grass. And again, we lift our cobra's head up high. Hissing like a snake. And breathing all the way out, coming down. Make your tummies nice and strong, lifting up all the way back. We see a jungle beetle. Hands around your sides. Creepy crawly beetle through the jungle grass. Breathing in, taking your hands underneath your shoulders, coming back to ride your elephant. Tummy's nice and strong, tuck your toes under and lift your hips. We're taking that elephant for a walk. Walking your heels up and down, up and down. It's really fun, isn't it, riding your elephant? We better look for danger. Taking your hand to the outside of your ankle, gaze underneath your arm. We're looking for danger. Can't see anything yet. Release your hand, let's check the other way. Take your hand to your ankle, look under your arm. Can you see any danger? We can't see anything yet. Taking your hands back down, breathing in, looking forward, and jump your feet to your hands. Ah, oh, I think I heard a noise. Oh no. It's okay, breathing in, and we can touch the treetops, touch the rooftop canopy of the jungle, breathing out and rolling out your shoulders. So I think for our journey through the jungle, we need to get tough. How about we be tribal warriors? That's a good idea. 
Take a step back with your right leg and then turn your feet to the other side. Raising your hands, bend your front knee. Tribal warriors ready for action. Gaze towards your middle finger ahead. Breathing in, take your arm back. And breathing out, back into our tribal warriors. Sweeping your back arm through, raise your heel and bend your knee. Super strong warriors, gaze upwards towards your hands. Breathing out. Maybe we can practice with our bow and arrow. Sweeping your hand across, draw your hand back. Pew! That was good practice. Swapping sides, turning your feet in the other direction. Gazing towards our middle, middle finger ahead. Super strong tribal warriors ready for action. Breathing in, raising your hand, gazing upwards towards your hand. And breathing out. Swooping the back arm through, bending your knee, lifting your back heel, gazing upwards towards your hand. Are you feeling strong now? We're not scared anymore, are we? Breathing out. Should we practice with our bow and arrow again? Swooping that back arm through, draw back your bow. That was great practice, wasn't it? And sweeping your arm up, over, windmill your arm over, step back into plank. Hide, I think I hear something coming. Should we look for danger? Taking your hand into the center, turning to the side, raising your hands. Can you see any danger? Looking around. I can't see anything at the moment. Taking your hand down. Looking the other way, breathing in. Can you see any danger? I can't see anything yet. Taking your hand down, bending your elbows, breathing in. I can see the hissing cobra. And breathing out. There's lots of insects in the jungle. I can see a creepy crawly locust. Taking your arms behind, breathing in, lifting your legs, lifting your arms and lifting your head. Creepy crawly insects. Crawling around through the jungle. Taking your hands down, making your tummy, tummy strong, breathing in, lifting up, and we see the creepy crawly beetle again. I never knew there were so many insects in the jungle. Placing your hands down, breathing in. Oh my goodness, I see some danger. Coming on to all fours, breathing in, arching your back, lifting your tail. It's a tiger. Taking your knee down, breathing in, raising your tail. Take 
taking your knee down. Tucking your toes under. Quick, jump on your elephant. Take your elephant for a ride. We've lucky we've escaped the tiger. And breathing in, looking forward, raising your leg behind, taking your foot to the outside of your hand. And we see a stick insect. Oh no, a creepy crawly stick insect. Taking your hand to the center. Making your tummy strong, breathing, reach up to the treetops. Oh no, it's a creepy crawly stick insect. Taking your hand down, you can push this leg into the arm and the arm into the leg. Breathing in, it's the creepy crawly stick insect. Help, run, hide. And breathing out. Making your tummy strong. Taking your leg behind, lifting up onto our elephant. Taking our elephant for a ride. And breathing in, taking your foot to the outside of your hand you may slide that foot back we find another stick insect oh no taking your hand to the center your tummy's nice and strong breathing and reaching up it's a sticky stick insect oh no they're so creepy breathing out taking your hand down pushing the leg into the arm the arm into the leg breathing in Sticky, stick insect. Yeah, it's all yucky. And breathing out, taking your hand down, quickly jump back onto your elephant for another ride. Keep walking through the jungle. Should we check for danger again? Releasing your hand, take your hand to your ankle, gaze underneath your arm, check in for any danger. We've already seen a tiger. What else could there be? Taking your other hand, check in on the other side. And breathing in, taking your hand back, looking forward, we're going to jump our feet outside of our hands into Frog pose. That's right. We're froggies. We can bounce up and down. I don't think they're poisonous frogs though, are they? What colour frogs are there? There's lots of different colour froggies in the jungle, isn't there? And breathing in, coming all the way up to standing, touching the treetops. And breathing out. Coming back down to our froggies. Bounce, 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 froggies. Breathing in, touching the treetops. Breathing out. Bouncing around, hopping around like the little froggies. And breathing in, coming all the way up to the treetops. And breathing out, rolling up your shoulders. Placing your hands onto your hips. Jump your feet together. What can I see now in the jungle? Taking a step back, turning your feet inwards. Heel toe your feet together slightly, but keep your feet turned out. Breathing in, bring your hands above your head, join your hands together and bend your knees. I can see a temple. I've heard about these temples. Sometimes they have treasure inside of them. Should we take a look in the temple? Breathing in, raise your heels. Wow, can you see anything yet?
Can you see anything yet? Oh my goodness, what's that? Take your hands down here. It's monkeys. Oh, 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 can't see any. Oh no, there they are. Oh. <laughs> Quick, hide. What do you think they're protecting in the temple? Oh my goodness, I can see. I can see a light shining in the temple. Reaching out, draw your hands back to center. It's a crystal, wow. A magical crystal. So pretty. I knew the temples had treasure. Heel toe your feet together. Breathing in, raising your knee. Folding forward. Extending. Holding out your crystal. You can feel how magical this crystal is full of power. You feel so strong now, like you're ready to face anything. Breathing in, drawing your knee in close, standing up, keep hold of your crystal, don't let it go. Breathing in, raising your knee, you can feel the strength of the crystal folding forward, Reaching out, feeling the power and the magic of the temple's magic crystal. Breathing in, draw your crystal in nice and tight. Hold on to your crystal. Okay, now we found our crystal. I believe we should try making our way out of the jungle so we don't come across any more danger. Let's say goodbye to all the animals we've seen. Breathing in, wave goodbye to all the birds in the trees. Folding down, wave goodbye to all the insects on the creepy crawly floor. Step back with your knee and back onto all fours. Now we can say goodbye to our friend, the elephant. Breathing in, lifting your trunk, breathing out. Breathing in, lifting your trunk up high, breathing out, say goodbye to our friend, the elephant, and coming back to center. Crossing your ankles, come back to seated. We can even say goodbye to the monkeys, can't we? Bye bye monkeys. First of all, we need to cross the bridge. Rolling down, bringing your feet hip distance apart. Dropping your heels down. Placing your hands down by your sides. Engaging and lift off, lifting your hips. Lifting your hips as high as possible, we can cross the bridge and start to make our way home. You can clasp your hands, walk your feet back towards you, and take deep breaths. We can think of all the wonderful things we've seen in the jungle today, and all the scary things we've seen in the jungle. Breathing out, taking your hands to your sides. Draw your knees in. We can say a last hello to the little beetle. A little goodbye. Bye beetle. Bye bye beetle. 
and taking your feet down to your mat. It's time to take a rest. Taking your arms wide to your sides. Take a breath in and lower your knees to the side, gazing over your shoulder. Taking a well-deserved rest. You've been so proud of yourself. You became a super strong tribal warrior today, ready to face anything. Breathing in, bringing your knees all the way back over to the other side, gazing over your shoulder. And begin to think, what was your favorite part of your journey today? I think mine was when I found the crystal. And breathing in, drawing your knees back to center. Give yourself a great big hug. And say, well done for finding the magical crystal. And now it's time for us to relax and take a rest at home. So taking your feet slightly apart, and your hands slightly apart. Gently rocking your head from side to side. Drawing your head back to centre, you can close your eyes and take in a deep, deep breath. Breathe out through your mouth. Allow your body to sink safely into the earth. Take another deep, deep breath in. Really feel every single area of your body. Breathe out through your mouth. Allow your body to become heavy. And I'd like you to see your crystal in your eyebrow center. So just gently lift your eyes, keeping your eyelids closed. With your eyes closed, just lift your eyes into your eyebrow center and see if you can see your magical crystal. And now begin to watch your crystal spinning, spinning around and around and around really, really, really fast. Keep your eyes on your crystal. Just noticing how heavy your hands feel, however your arms feel. And the backs of your shoulders, the whole of your back and your hips. Just allow your hips to sink into the earth. Keep your crystal spinning and your upper legs and your lower legs and your heels. Feel your heels sinking into the earth. And the soles of your feet, all of your toes, the tops of your feet, and your ankles, your lower legs, your knees, and your upper legs, and your hips, feeling the whole of your body becoming heavy and relaxed. Keep watching your crystal spinning in your eyebrow center, feeling your belly relax, feel your belly sink down safely into the earth. Feeling your heart become soft and open. And now watch your crystal spinning in between your eyebrows. And you can see different colours as the crystal spins. And you can see red. Your crystal has become red and you feel safe. And now your crystal is spinning and it's become orange, glowing bright orange. And you feel happiness and joy. Your crystal is spinning even faster in your eyebrow center. Your crystal has become bright yellow, as bright as the sun. You feel confident and ready for anything. 
crystal spinning. It's now become bright green, as green as the rainforest. And you are loving and you are loved. The crystal is spinning. It's become bright turquoise blue. The brightest blue you've ever seen. And you feel fearless. You are not afraid of anything. Now your crystal has become the darkest blue you've ever seen. Spinning in your eyebrow centre. And you have complete understanding. You understand yourself and you understand the world around you. Now your crystal has become bright white brightest white you have ever seen all of the colors together shine and radiate the brightest white of the crystal well and now you feel complete and you feel completely peaceful And now you can listen to your breath and notice how calm and steady your breath is, how your belly rises when you breathe in and how your belly falls when you breathe out. Feeling the earth beneath you, hearing the sounds around you can connect with your fingers and begin to wiggle your fingers. Maybe draw circles with your wrists and you can connect with your feet. Wiggle your toes and draw circles with your ankles. So you're waking up your body. Taking a deep breath in. Bring your hands above your head, point your toes, point your fingers, taking the biggest stretch of your life. And slowly walk your feet back towards you, take hold of your knees and give yourself a huge, huge hug. You can kiss your knees and say, well done. You did the best yoga class ever today, gently rocking out your back from side to side. You can roll over onto your side now. Just take a moment's rest. Comfort yourself. And notice how that feels and hold on to that feeling. And slowly make your way up to a comfortable seated position. Thank you everybody for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed your yoga class through the jungle. So if you'd like to comment on the Keep Essex Active YouTube channel, please comment, maybe say what your favorite yoga pose was for today. And maybe you can like and subscribe. Should we say goodbye in the yoga way? Bringing your hands to your heart center, taking a breath in. Namaste. Bye bye, everybody.